Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It has been so long since I sat over here and filmed a video. I don't know why, I guess I'm just too lazy to fix myself and just sit and talk. Anyway, in today's video, I'm going to be talking about my three new piercings that I got professionally done. I usually get my piercings done by a gun or I just pierce them by myself, which is technically wrong. You can also watch my video, but like, don't do that. I learned my mistake. So I got three new piercings, the Rook, the Conch, and the Forward Helix. I'll be showing you guys these three piercings. I'll tell you the scale, which one hurts the most, which one's the least, which one I got many problems with, and so on. So let's get on with the video. Okay, so I've got the Conch and the Rook on my right ear, and then the Forward Helix on my left. I got the Conch and the Rook exactly at the same time. I personally expected that the Rook would hurt me so so much but then in reality the rook was so like i don't know it felt so good while piercing it and it wasn't painful at all but the conch one i had so many problems with and it even formed a colloid in case you don't know what a colloid is i'll put a pic over here so basically the conch piercing over here uh formed the colloid and it really bothers me i just have it pierced with the arch piercing so this is how it looks like and this is my rook the rook one formed a tiny small colloid under here but other than that it's all good it doesn't even hurt me i'm able to sleep if you tell me to remove all my piercings i'll just keep the rope one because like it feels like it doesn't exist so does the tragus so from scale 1 to 10 on how painful it was i can say it was like probably six ish i got them both in the same time like exactly the needle was here and then the other needle was here and like i'm like oh, okay okay chill and then the rook one hurts four out of ten the rook one perfect i love it the conch one got infected really fast maybe because i didn't take enough care or like something like that so the next day i decided to go back to the piercing shop and get my forward helix done i was actually confused on either getting the forward helix or the rook i got the forward helix i'm like why have rook on both ears which i regret i wish i got the rook one so all of my three ear piercings got pierced by 16 gauge but my forward helix i pierced it with a 16 gauge with a cbr ear piercing and it hurt me so so much he even was having difficulties getting the ball inside the barbell and something like that it was so painful i hated my life i regretted getting this the pain was about 8 out of 10 and then i had so many problems with it it started getting uh, infected and like big and then the piercing started hitting my ear and then my ear is the one who's getting hurt and in the middle of the night i might wake up and like in pain i'm sorry if i'm looking at the viewfinder because like so i decided to remove the cbr piercing and get like the flat backs i inserted the flat back and it was too long that the piercing was that that my ear was gonna like i don't know was just rejecting so i removed the flat back and then decided to get a small nose piercing that these thin ones and like get it inside even though like it's a 16 gauge and the nose, nose piercing is like I don't know how many gauges but it's like very tiny like i just got the small tiny circular nose piercing and like put it over here and then the next day it was a bit painful but it started healing and like getting better until now it's like thank god thank god it's perfect it's not even getting infected not being painful no problems with it i'm able to sleep on it so it's all good thank god this is how my forward helix looks like i removed all my ear piercings you can also check the video of all about my 14 ear piercings i'll just link it down below or like put a suggestion over here or something like that i removed them and kept the ones i like the most you can also see like there are a few holes over here like scars but like if i try to put any piercing inside it just doesn't fit in because it just got healed and i love how my ear looks like right now it's i think it's pretty i don't know maybe if i add in like something over here on the left ear it would look even nicer i'm not sure i'm even planning on getting maybe my wrist piercing or like a belly piercing or the smiley i'm not sure i'm just like thinking about them 
but so far this is how my ear looks like anyway guys that's it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel i'm almost about to hit 1k subscribers and i'm so happy and excited even though i'm not posting that much but i'm just gonna try posting more vlogs more videos have a good day y'all bye